west heating up should be good for the rest of the season the weather kind of heating up as well it's, uh, it's windy out here <laughs> as well uh, back in may though the special olympics washington branch had a very special event the summer Olympics, a great event that FSN very proud to be partners with, involved with, and sponsor that. And Angie Mintink has more on the Special Olympics Washington Summer Games. This past May, over 2,500 athletes from the state of Washington embarked for Fort Lewis and the 2009 Special Olympic Summer Games. Among the competitors, Shoreline Washington's Andrew Bryant. An avid runner and participant in the 2009 Boston Marathon, Bryant went on to capture the gold in both the 5 and 10K races. Andrew Bryant. But it wasn't finished. A gold medal in the shot put would be the topper on Bryant's unforgettable performance. Andrew Bryant, just one of the athletes living their dream at the 2009 Special Olympic Summer Games. All right, so we saw Andrew running there. We now get to see Andrew live with Angie Mentick inside the dugout, Ange. Brad, thank you very much. Actually, I have Andy and I also have his dad, Jerry, here as well. I want to talk about your Special Olympics accomplishments, but I am just amazed that you ran the Boston Marathon and you didn't run it once, you ran it twice. Okay, so what would you tell maybe somebody out there who's thinking about training for a marathon? Uh, I was thinking in a Joe. How many miles would you have to run? Nine, 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 uh, 12, 9 or 10. 8 or 9 or 10 or 11 or 12. A day, huh? So 8 or 9 uh, miles a day. Yeah. 8 or eight 9, 10 miles a day. Excellent. Now, it's not uh, just the Boston Marathons. You've run more marathons than that. Yes. I ran, How many? I ran six marathons. Six marathons. Oh, my goodness. How often do you go through shoes? Uh, every two months. Every uh, couple months. All right. Uh, speaking of of uh, of, uh, of uh, uh, your your Special Olympics accomplishments, you ran the 5K, the 10K, the 4x400, and also the shot put. You won a gold medal in three or four of those. Which one's your favorite, Andy? I uh, the shot put. Really? Shot put's your favorite. Yes. Uh, what about uh, uh, speaking of favorites, uh, favorite mariner? Uh, the Seahawks. <laughs> he likes them all. He did tell me that Ichiro was his favorite Mariner, but you're also a Seahawks fan, huh? Yeah, uh, Ichiro. Ichiro, okay. Ichiro is his favorite. Dad, thank you very much for being here, Jerry. Yeah, thank you very much. All Appreciate right. It. Hey, uh, this is your call to arm, folks. For more information on Special Olympics Washington, you can log on to www.sowa.org, or you can call 206-362-4949. Uh, you can get involved or uh, make a donation uh, to make sure that uh, guys like Andy continue running in the Boston Marathon. Can you believe this guy, Brad? Unbelievable. Not just the Boston, but as you I said, six I don't think I've run that marathons? many miles total in my entire life. <laughs> if you added them up, huh? Not quite. All right, Angie, thank you very much. Yeah, very special athlete right there. Please help him out and the rest of the special Olympians here in the state of Washington. Well, a milestone reach for Andy in those six Marathons reached a milestone reach last night in age. Yes, the Rally Fry winner last night. It's We're also talking about how these guys have the stature that when things go bad, they can put it in perspective and joke a little bit about it. All right, thanks, Bill. You know, before this game even started, I had the opportunity to meet a very special athlete, Andy Bryant, uh, also uh, or competed in Special Olympics Washington this uh, past summer games or in these past summer games. And he attended today's game with his dad, Jerry, there. He won three gold medals in the 5K, the 10K, and then also in the shot put. He uh, had an opportunity to enjoy today's game, take in uh, a lot of the sights and sounds of Safeco Field, and was kind enough to speak to me during the game as well. All right, so uh, we're a ways into this game. So far, what's your favorite part, Andy? Uh, the, 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 the Mariners with the, 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 the dugout. You meaning Jason Vargas. Jason Vargas came over and talked to you, right? Yeah. Yeah, what did he tell you? He's, he's, uh, he was playing the catcher. He was playing catch with the ball. Yeah, and uh, he really liked uh, the fact that you wore ASIC shoes to run all your marathon ends yeah. in, huh? 
He was pretty impressed with the fact that you've run not one, but two Boston marathons. He was impressed. Yeah, he was really impressed. He said he would never, ever, ever even attempt to do that. Uh, have you had something to eat yet? Yeah, I had a hamburger and a fries and a vanilla shake. And a shake, nice, all right, perfect. Hey, um, besides, uh, besides Jason Vargas, uh, what have you enjoyed inside the game? Did you see Rob Johnson hit the double and clear all the bases? Yes, he did. Yeah, did you scream your head off? Yeah, I screamed my head off. <laughs> Very good. Um, and then what about the ejection? Did you see the injection where Scott Harrison, they said, what did they tell him? You're out of the game. You're out of the game. Yeah, he's out of the game. What he did, he talked back to the umpire talked back and got thrown out of the game. Yeah, that's what happens, right? If you talk back, you get thrown out. He got thrown out of the game. All right. So um, what uh, what, uh, what do you want to see the Mariners do here? Uh, they hit the ball. Hit the ball, exactly, and win the game. Catch, it, catch the ball. You know what? You're sounding more and more like a skipper all the time. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Andy. Thank you. Folks, right now, this is your call to arms. For more information on Special Olympics Washington or to learn how you can get involved, log on to www.sowa.org or you can call 206-362-4949. Brad and Bill, um, that is one shirt, that gold shirt that he was wearing. That's one shirt I will never own. He gets that uh, for running the Boston Marathon, and he actually is going to run the uh, Seattle Rock and Roll Marathon on the 27th here coming up. The guy, uh, you can't get him to stop running. He's a machine. We he talked is. about the pregame show with you, and Six marathons this guy has run. A couple of Boston marathons, and Angie, Angie asked him what he ate. And you said, hey, pff, whatever the guy wants to eat. You kidding me? Yeah. He's running marathons. He can have three shakes if he wants. Yeah, I'd like to have that <laughs> metabolism. Might as well just tape it on me and just let it <laughs> hang there. Well, if you run a couple of marathons, maybe you'd see some better results. Yeah, they'd have to Easy probably that, right? IV me up about halfway oh through, though. Oh, my goodness, maybe. they are difficult. All right, more to get to on the post-game show here. Rob Johnson getting clicked.